solar pv and battery integrated with the grid so this is solar pv system and battery system so this root integration and uh, this solar pv is controlled by means of uh, incremental uh, conductance mbpt not to extract the maximum power okay so this incremental conductance mbpt is controlled the switch uh, switch of the igpt of the mosfet okay now to extract the maximum power from the solar pv and it consists of battery so battery charging to charging based upon uh, uh, pv power so if pv power having a uh, that mean pv is greater than uh, load power then the, the PV power going to be excess PV power going to be charge the battery. So by means of this bidirectional DC DC converter, if PV power is less than uh, load power, during that time the battery going to be discharge the battery. The discharge not to supply the load. Okay. And then this bidirectional DC DC converter and battery going to be controlled by means of this control logic. So here we are going to use voltage control that means this is known as bus. So this is bus and this is known as bus. Here bus voltage we are going to maintain at 220 volt. So for that we are going to use this voltage controller. So this is going to be controlled that uh, uh, IGBT of that uh, bidirection converter. Okay. So it will be going to be controlled this uh, IGBT not to a charge a battery or discharge a battery according with the PV panel power. Okay. And then this bus is connected with the full pitch converter and the grid. So this is going to be considered as grid. And then this is a full pitch converter. And then this inverter can be controlled by means of a, a DQ frame control, right? That means uh, here we are going to generate the reference current TQ reference, D reference, Q reference, and then here you can see that actual current of the inverter. So, this is actual current of the inverter. So, based upon this actual current of the inverter, we have to generate the actual uh, DQ current. So, this DQ current is going to be compared with the, this reference TQ, and then it's processed via voltage PA controller. That means BA controller. So this BA controller generates the reference uh, DQ signal. Okay. And then it can be converted into AB quantity. Okay. And then this uh, control signal, this AB quantity control signal is going to be used for generating the pulse. So it's going to be used for generating the pulse to control the inverter. Okay. So this is the logic. So here I am going to explain with them. So here we can control this current reference. That means just to fix the current value. So how much uh, current are, should be injected to the grid or how much power we are going to inject to the grid, right? So when you go to adjust this value, you can see the variation of the uh, grid current and inverter current. That means sharing of solar PV and battery with the uh, grid. Okay. So here I am fixing at 0.5 in peak amplitude okay next time we will make this model so this is pv power and boost converter power so this is battery voltage and then uh, this is inverter voltage and the inverter current so how now you can see that the current value is maintained at 0.5 peak amplitude so if suppose i am going to change this value right so you will get some changes in the charging of battery as well as uh, uh, this grid current for example i am going to change to 2 okay so you will get some changes in the uh, charging of battery and and grid side right now you can see that so inverter current supply nearly 2 peak amplitude current because of increasing that uh, uh, current from that solar PV in battery, so you will see that uh, reduction in the grid current sharing, right? 
and also you can see that because of that uh, current reference change in the uh, grid inverter right so what will be happen the charging current also decreases right because the solar pv is supplying the power to the uh, grid according with the, this reference term okay next i am going to change this value to 0.5 again so we will see the variation now yeah now you can see that because of changing current reference what uh, what happened to the grid uh, sharing that mean uh, inverter share only 0.5 peak amplitude current but what happened to that uh, grid current sharing it, it increases so according with that the reference current we are fixing right the sharing of uh, solar pv current and battery and then uh, grid going to be change okay so this is uh, grid integrated with the solar pv and battery thank you